Family members of Alex Murdoch's former housekeeper speak out publicly for the first time the family was initially told the woman tripped over dogs and they thought she had a head injury because they saw blood said Ginger Harriet Hadwin, her sister. The housekeeper spent 21 days in intensive care before she died, Hadwin said. After Gloria's funeral, Murdoch told the women's family he wanted to make sure the boys are taken care of because he loved Gloria that much said Ginger but three years after her death, the Satterfield family had not seen any money from Murda. I said, I just don't think these boys are gonna get what they deserve Satterfield's brother, Eric Harriet, Jr. told NBC News' Craig Melvin. According to attorney Eric Bland, who represents the Satterfields, the family has received none of the $4.3 million insurance settlement awarded and they are still investigating where that money went. It's impossible to burn that kind of money in Hampton, South Carolina," said Bland, according to affidavits released by South Carolina Law Enforcement Division, Murdoch coordinated with Satterfield's family to sue himself in order to seek an insurance settlement with the stated intent to give the proceeds to the Satterfield family to pay for funeral expenses and monetary compensation for Satterfield's children. After Murdoch's arrest, his attorneys. Dick Hypotlian and Jim Griffin, released a statement saying he intends to fully cooperate with this investigation, as he is with the investigation into the murder of his wife and son. He deeply regrets that his actions have distracted from the efforts to solve their murders the statement said. Dateline NBC airs more of the exclusive interview with the family tonight at 9 Eastern Time. Thank you for watching. Please, subscribe.